So we have a theorem here that all polynomials are continuous and the x values they're continuous on is all the real numbers. And remember polynomials are defined, their domain is all real numbers. So why would all polynomials be continuous? Uh, so we're gonna show that if P of X is a polynomial, we're gonna show that P is continuous for any X value in the real numbers. So we're gonna look at what is limit. Now, first of all, what is a polynomial? Remember a polynomial can be written as, uh, let's see, I'm gonna change this for any X in R. So P uh, of X is a n x to the n plus a n minus one x to the n minus one plus dot 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 plus a one x plus a zero. And we're now gonna take the limit as uh, x approaches, uh, we'll just use some number b. I didn't wanna use a because in the standard way we write polynomials, we use a for the coefficients. So I'm gonna write this out. Uh, we're taking the limit of this, but remember the limit splits up across all of the addition. It also splits up across the multiplying of coefficients into the x's. And so that means that the first one could be written as a n times limit of x to the n. As x approaches b plus, coming from that plus, a n minus one times limit, x approaches b, same limit, x to the n minus one, plus dot dot dot, plus, we're now on this term, a one times limit, x approaches b, uh, this will just be x to the first power plus last step just a zero by itself. There's no x's there. All right, from here we have our limit rules, which says that x to the n power, the limit of that is just, you can just plug this value in here. This is b to the n. Now do the exact same thing here. times b to the n minus one plus dot 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 plus a one, this limit is just b plus a zero. And from here, what is this? This is p of b. It's the same polynomial, just plugging in a b in for x. So we just showed the limit as x approaches b, p of x, equals P of B, it says limit equals value, which is the definition for P continuous at, and we chose, uh, I didn't put any stipulations on which number in here, so it could have been any number at any x value in the real numbers. So we just prove that all polynomials are continuous.